When working with body filler, you know, one common mistake some guys make is they, you know, open up the can and they stir a little bit on top and it's just hard as a rock. And what's happened is, is the last 10 times they've opened it up, they stirred a little bit on top and as Bondo says, Bondo is mainly plastic, body fillers are plastic and a resin, it's a fiberglass resin. And over time, that the plastic parts fall out of it and the resin comes to the top. Well, after you've used it a few times, you reach in, you stir it around, and you haven't bothered to actually thin out the entire can, or you've just mixed it on top, and you've taken the resins out of the can then by just stirring the top of the can. What you end up with is a hard brick, and what the way to get around that is just to take some fiberglass resin, pour that into your body filler, and then mix that. And you'll find that that loosens up the body filler, and the resins in there are the same for fiberglass as they are for most body fillers. So it becomes sort of a natural thing to thin it with, even if you're just wanting to like make a really light coat of body filler, now you're ready to uh, have a good consistency and you can apply that and be ready to get some filling done.